coming back from the local football game it's a friday night and i've decided hey we're gonna keep harvesting so i was talking to a guy down there and he's gonna help me harvest uh austin told me to come oh my gosh this is a story for you listen to this austin told me to come to the local football game i'm expecting oh dude you're playing that's sweet austin you know the local guy that helps me out the local high school kid that helps me out right i go to the game and i'm like okay what number's austin you know i get in the stands right and i'm, I'm not seeing him on the roster i'm like oh okay maybe he's the water boy right so i look at the water boy no austin and then i, I look down at the cheerleaders i'm like is that is that Austin? Austin was the male cheerleader there. I'm like, dude, Austin, I thought you were telling me you're gonna play in the game, dude. But seriously, don't tell him that. Otherwise, he's gonna get. I, I, I seriously thought I was going to watch Austin playing the football game. But he was the male cheerleader there. I'm, I'm not between me and you, okay? Don't tell Austin I said this, okay? But that, I was expecting him to be playing. That's it. Anyways, I think Austin is gonna come down too. I'm pretty sure he's gonna come down too. Uh, he. Obviously, he didn't have too rough of night, uh, but he's going to come down to you after, uh, after he's done cheerleading. And then uh, and then we're going to get harvesting. And then I'm going to give... Oh, you know what? That's right. I talked to Stevio, so I'm going to give Stevio a call quick. Hey, what's up? Hey, that was a heck of a game, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that was a good game. Uh, so, are you still down to help me harvest? Oh, yeah. Okay, we're going to be yeah. running... I'm, I'm trying to run for probably two hours tonight, and then I'm going to run all day tomorrow. Okay. Okay, do you, right. are you going to bring the case down then? Yeah, I just have to go pick up the corn head I bought at the lot, and then I'll be headed down. Okay, okay, and then uh, I'm going to have Austin probably run the grain cart, and maybe the, he, I think he should be done cheerleading soon, and we'll have him run grain cart, and maybe grady wagons or something like that. Was he that male cheerleader I saw? <laughs> yes, dude, yeah, oh, yes, okay, don't, yes, that was him, that was him, yeah, yeah, that oh, was him. Man. Okay. So, I don't know if he's going to come in his cheerleading suit or not, but. He should be here soon. So yeah, yeah, right, uh, yeah. I I don't know. I don't know if we should ask him about. It. Oh, he's. You know what? He's pulling up right now. I think he must be done with the game. All right. Hopefully he changed us. Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah. Hopefully he did. Oh gosh. I don't know if I should talk to him about it. Uh, anyways. Okay. I'll see you uh, here which soon. Which field are you on? Uh, come to the main farm. We'll okay. be probably at the main farm. Or actually, you know what? It's the field across from the main farm. You should see us out in the field. It's just right across from the home farm here. All right. I'll be there in about five to ten. Okay, sounds good. I'll see you then. All right, later. You did good out there, Austin. I was proud of you, man. Yeah. No, thank you. Thank you. Nice job. You did a heck of a job. Okay. Uh, so I see you changed out of your clothes. That's good. That's very good. Um, mm -hmm. but uh, what we're gonna, I'm gonna have you run the green cart. I think today. Have you ran the 970 yet? Yeah, you have. You have ran the plant tractor. Yeah. That's right. Obviously. Right. Uh, but. Stevio uh, is actually coming down too. He was at the game, the game today too. I talked to Stevio. Oh, okay. I, didn't, I didn't see him there. Yeah, no, he was at the game. Oh, I didn't see him there. Mm. But he was in the stands. I think he's bringing the case onto the farm. He's bringing the case onto the farm, man. We'll <sighs> see how she runs. Runs. Put her up to the test against the combine. Against the. You know what? Speaking of combine, I gotta get a new combine. I gotta. Honestly, I mean, I'd love again? to get. Yeah. Okay. We're not gonna get another one. We're gonna trade one in. Uh, the 9670, it's having a tough time keeping up with these corn yields, man. So I'm thinking again, uh, just train up. I don't know. Should we go S670, S680? Up to you, man. You're the you're the guy with the checkbook, so. Okay. Okay. Well, I'll figure that out. So so the 7R is completely full here. So we're going to leave. You know what? I think I'm going to just put this corn in my uh, in my bins here. So if you want to fire up the 7R, just start unloading into these bins here. That'd be great. And I'm going to pull out the combine right now. All right. And then we got to move the 8130 over that field, 8970 over that field. We'll keep rolling on that field. And then we'll move to the home farm after that. All right. Well, let's get going. Here she is. She's a little underpowered, but she's staying in there. Uh, she's handling it. The 9670 STS. I'm thinking for sure we got to trade this in. I don't know. I could go to like a 9770 or 9870. That'd be pretty cool. I got to see what Buck has. I haven't been around his dealership for a while now. So we'll hop in here, get her going, and then... Uh, we're going to harvest through, through night a little bit. Now, Stevio doesn't live too far away, so he should be here pretty soon. I think he'll be here soon. We're going to need all the lights we can get. So I'm going to turn on. Let's see what we got. So those are like low dim. And then here's high dim. Or brights, I guess. Brights will do. It'll be nice. They're LEDs too. They're not like the yellow, just bland light. They're nice aftermarket LEDs we got on here too. So this should be nice tonight. So we don't actually have that many acres left. We probably have about 20 acres left. I think what we could probably do here, instead of bringing the 8130 and the 7R out to the field, what we probably should do is I'll just have you run the 8970 back to here and unload it in the gravity wagons. Yeah, that works. 
Okay, as long as you're cool, just cross the road, because you'll be crossing the road a lot, but... Would yeah, you... well, it's, it's getting later, so there yeah. won't be as much traffic. True, just be careful. Stevios, I think he's going to be here any second. He'll be rolling on in yeah, with Case. Be. be nice Already? to him, though, okay? Be nice to him what with Case. Yeah, I know nice. how you are with Case, people. Be nice, <sighs> okay? Okay, so here's what we have left. This is probably, I don't know, 15 acres. Honestly, we'll get this knocked out quick tonight. By the time Stevio gets here, there might not be much left, and it's almost like... It's almost pointless for Stevio to uh, to come tonight because I think I can get this knocked out pretty quick. But in the morning, you know, Grant, you got your ears on. Yeah, sorry. Yep, I'm here. All right. Uh, just let me know when you need unloading. Okay. Give me a heads up when Stevio gets here too. I'll swing by and we'll talk to him and form a game plan here. But yeah. All right. I got you know I got uh, I only got 50 bushels in here right now, so it'll okay, be a while yeah, yet. All right. What what radio station do you listen, usually listen to in there? You got some ACDC rolling? ACDC? Uh, no, no, I'm I'm not a rock fan. Really? Post Malone? No. Post Malone? I I don't mind his music. I don't okay. Mind his music. Uh, okay, I'm I'm one of those guys that likes EDM. Oh if, man. If you know what that is? You're gonna blow the speakers in that tractor, dude. Yeah, probably. Uh, I don't think I need to worry. I'm not listening to Skrillex. Yeah. See, I, I honestly used to be, like, I'll listen to pretty much anything in the combine, but I used to be where I'll listen to everything but Screamo. And I've started liking Screamo, especially when it gets late at night oh, and no. you need to keep on, on, on track, you know? I've started liking <laughs> Screamo, on, Screamo now, so there's nothing I don't like almost. Yeah. So I got about 174 bushels. I got about another 200 bushels that I can go into this. But right towards the end here, I think what I'm going to have you do is pull up and uh, unload me because there's no way I'm going to be able to make another pass down I don't think okay I'd say you could probably come unload me now I only have All 230 right. bushels but we're not going to make it another whole pass back how are the lights on that tractor uh, they're, they're moderate they're not okay. the greatest but oh shoot there's a deer that just ran out you see that there's a buck too oh yeah I, got, I caught a glimpse of it <laughs> Holy crap, he cut right in front of you. Oh, shoot. My bad, my oh, bad. Oh, my, 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 my bad. My bad. What are you doing? My cruise control is off. Here we go. Oh, shoot. I'm spilling. Oh, Holy shoot. crap. Dude, I'm trying to get in the right gear for this. You're good. It's, seven it's mile tough. an hour. Okay, seven? Seven mile an hour. So I'm not going to be able to unload all of it right here. That's fine. Just hit me when I'm going on the next pass back. When my auger's okay. out this way again. Because we got all enough right. unloaded there. It's all good. Yo, Austin, I'm about full. I'm going to make it to the end here, but I'm going to need you right when I start this next row. Down now. 10-4. There we go. <laughs> we got this down. We need to work better on getting this down because we're. I'm. I'm it, honestly, a lot of it's mine. I'm struggling here too. It's dark out. It's tough to see. Dude, night harvest is pretty darn cool. It is through here. It is. I need to slow it down. Probably is what I should be doing. Oh, is that Stevio? I see. Uh, hey, you know, can you hear me? Am I in range? You're in range. Yep. I don't see you though, but you're in range. I see him. Where's he at? Coming uh, right at the end of the field here. Oh, okay. Stevio, so I'm thinking you can work that in and then I'll just work at this end. We'll just keep rolling. Or do you want me to follow you? Ooh, actually, you know what? I'll follow you, Stevio. All right. Try to keep up. Stevio, what speed are you running at, man? Uh, seven mile an hour. Same. Man, seems like you're going what faster. Is, uh, what's your yield monitor reading at? It's reading 190 bushels to the acre over here. Getting uh, 195 on this end. Over You're getting here. 195. See, on, yeah, on the other end of the field, I was getting 196, but right now it's only showing 190. Maybe my yield monitor is off and yours is accurate, or what? I don't know. Maybe I'm not pushing as much out the back. True, true. Oh, you missed some, Stevio. She's one oh, staining still. That's for the deer. <laughs> yeah, so I'm thinking we'll get this field done tonight, and then uh, you can head home, and then we'll get up early in the morning, 7 a.m. Keep going. I got the home field to do there's about uh 120 acres there that we gotta knock out it's all corn it's gonna be good yielding corn too so that'll take all day tomorrow probably all right sounds good it's not gonna take long for this field yeah we'll be done quick with this one especially with the two of us run yep uh grant you how long until you are gonna need unloading there i got about 200 bushels left um i could probably get unloaded on this next round coming back uh towards the south here that'd work good Okay, I was gonna say I'll go uh, dump the tr this uh, this load, but I'll just wait. How much room do you have in there? Cause I could top you off here. Oh, I still got lots. Okay. I'm just over fifty percent. Okay. Grant, you get a new cart? I did. I did. We've been trading equipment like crazy. Yeah. Grant can't seem to keep up his mind. It's a fourteen hundred bushel grain cart. I think this will work good. Whoa. 
That's crazy. Yeah. What's really nice about it is just having the storage just out in the field, I guess. 14 yard bushels, you can store a lot of grain in there. It's nice to just have almost as a holding tank. Yeah, that big floating tires probably floats right over the ground, too. Yeah, and then on the duels, me and Austin decided to throw 8970, and we had. Uh, we had some fatties sitting around, so we tossed some fatties on there, and uh, and that works good because we got the big uh, Kinsey with the big tires, and then the 8970 with big tires. Everything seems to be working good. So, do you want to park? Uh, hmm. Do you want to park the case at my place then, for the night? Yeah. Is it, is it allowed over there? It is. It is. Austin might. Okay. Austin might. The dog might not let you in there, but uh, yeah, it's allowed. I'll allow it. Don't you just love the look of uh, combines with their lights on? <laughs> they look I good, think. especially with that sunset. It's picture perfect right here. Yeah. Huh. I wonder where Austin's going to park that. Oh, I better move out of the way. Uh-oh. Well, we better get to bed, boys. Here, I'll show you guys your rooms. All right. What do you mean? I'm going home. Oh, you're going home? Yeah. Mm. I don't live that far away. Oh, okay. Okay. Steve is going to stay the night. You sure? I got a bed, uh, man. Maybe, maybe I'll stay over here. Okay. You have to uh, wash your uniform. Wash my <laughs> uniform. Yeah. I, I toss it in the washer. I got yeah. a washer dryer combo, so I can just set yeah. it to wash and dry. I got you. Okay. You performed good though. You did. Uh huh. You gonna turn some lights on in here? <laughs> we need to. <clears throat> Dude, you almost got nice. the exact same build as my house. Really? You copied my yeah. house? No, you copied mine. Oh, uh, who didn't shut the front door? You can get raccoons oh. in here. Okay, I'll show you guys your beds. Uh, Austin, here's your room. Oh yeah, you're funny. You're funny. No, Whatever. Awesome. Are you are you potty trained? We got a little. <laughs> oh wow, wow! You guys just bully me everywhere I go. Huh? Well, I mean, okay. So all I got is couches, but I do have some PCs. If you guys want to play some farms tonight, you know, before you go to bed, I got two Apex game PCs here: Squad PC and the Squad Plus PC. Uh, whatever one you guys want. You guys can fight over them. Who gets the squad plus? Who gets the squad PC? But you guys want to play some farm sim. My son plays okay. all the time, so it's downloaded on both PCs. He brings his buddies over usually. So, and then one of you guys can sleep on this couch, one on the other. All right. Ugh. Evio, morning. Hey. I got some coffee hey, for you, man. You? Oh, sweet. <laughs> yeah, I only had enough for two cups. Looks like Austin. Is he? Is Austin still sleeping up there? I'm awake. I'm awake. Oh, okay. There he is. You got some coffee? You're not old enough. Yeah. What? Dude, I'm 16. Nah, rule is 18. Screw, screw, screw that. I'm <laughs> going to get coffee. Where the heck do you keep this stuff? We're out of coffee, dude. We better get after it. Nope, yeah. I need coffee. You going to run to Casey's? Oh. Yep. Start her up, man. She's going to have... Oh, that was easy. Pick up, hey, pick me up some donuts, too. Bring some donuts some back. Some donuts? All right. Yep. Okay, it's, it's on you, Grant. Yeah, it's on he, you. Hold on, here's, my, here's the business card. All right. There you I'll go. Be, I'll be back in like 10 minutes. Okay. <laughs> okay, well, we probably should get the equipment fired up, warmed up and stuff. You can get the case, and then I'll get uh, I'll get all these tractors started. All right, uh, can I borrow your grease gun? Yep, yep. It's, uh, it's in the shop there. All right. Well, here we go. We'll see if she'll start. She is struggling, so it is. It's 35 degrees outside, and I never plug this in. This combine, this is gonna be tough. Come on. There we go. Hopefully that case fires up. I had a tough time starting. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. It's 35 degrees out, man. That was. We should have plugged these in overnight, probably. That's all right. Nothing that a can of ether can't fix. True. Oh, she's struggling too. There he goes. There we go. Nice, yeah. Honestly, the deer took a lot longer to start out there. That started up pretty quick. It's it's normal. Hey, uh, I was wondering if I could uh, grab some fuel over there. Yeah, 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 for sure, for sure. And here we go for the 8970. Okay, 8970 fired up. It took me a couple tries, man. I didn't get to record that the best, but 8970, she's going. Okay, now these 8130 and especially the 7R should have an easier time starting, I would think. 8970 was probably the worst starter so far, but we'll see. 8130 shouldn't be as bad, I would I want to guess. Come on. 
There we go. Okay. 81 30 fired up. We'll let her warm up. And then now we'll fire up the 7R. Now let's see what we have for it here. Let me start the 7R quick. Come on. Yeah, the 7R wasn't as bad. That's nice. That's good. So for grain, it looks like we're right here. You can see where it cuts off at the window, luckily. So, I don't know. This is probably almost half full. A little less than half full, it looks like. And then this back gravity wagon is empty. But these two gravity wagons are completely full. So once we fill both of these up, we'll either run to town or we'll just run back to here and just store it in these bins. I got to decide because we got a lot more grain that needs to come in. A lot of the grain's going to come in these bins. But if prices are good right now, I'll take it straight to the elevator. <laughs> it looks like Stevio's enjoying himself a little in the 8970. I think he's going to pull that up and fuel up. And then uh, let's see if the 8130 or 7R needs fuel. Uh, we're good. We got about, it seems like we got about a little over half a tank. Combine, we got about half a tank. And uh, we're going to use a lot today, so I better so I better fuel up this combine. Oh, as we're going to run empty today. There's no way we make it through that field with half a tank. There we go. We are full. So now I guess we're just waiting for Austin to get back, and then we're going to get going. Perfect timing. Austin's back. Yep. Hopefully yeah. we got the right donuts, so. I bet he got the ones with the whole bunch of sprinkles on it. <laughs> I bet he did too. Coffee for you, donut for you, coffee for you, donut for you. Thank oh, you. Oh man, why do I get the extra sprinkles? Uh, <laughs> don't you like extra sprinkles? Huh? Uh, you got me. Okay, so what I'm thinking is me and Stevia will run two headlands around here. Unless, actually, Austin, do you want to run the deer? Or if you guys want to switch, mm. feel free to run whatever. We can start I'm with headlands. I'm the green cart. But. Okay. Okay, then I'll, I'll run a headland to lead away. Stevio, you can follow me. And then uh, I got to figure out, huh? Here, let me, here, ch t take a look at my iPad here. How the field shape. All right. Okay, so what are we looking at here? So it's, it's honestly like one of the weirdest shapes ever. I got to figure it out. Like half the field, we will run north and south. And half the field will harvest east to west. And then I got to call Jake or get somebody down here with a semi. That way we can unload. Because these grain carts or these gravity wagons are going to get real full here soon. So we got to figure that oh, out. Yeah. Actually, I I just dropped Jake off a coffee and donut, and he said he's trucking throughout the day. So if you need him, just give him a call. Okay, I may give him a call then. That'd be nice. All right. Hello? Hey, Jake. How you doing? Uh, not so bad. How about yourself? Pretty good. We're actually getting rolling with the combines here, and Austin said he met you when he was picking up some donuts or coffee, I think. Yep. Yeah, you came down and gave me a coffee. <laughs> that was nice of him. And then you're trucking all day, then, is what he told me, right? Yeah, I'm trucking intermittently, so I'm still trying to get work done on my farm, but I'm uh, I'm also on schedule to run truck Ooh. for the co-op. So. Okay, could we have you run a couple loads today? Absolutely, or? yeah. Okay, uh, honestly, we could probably have you down here in 20 minutes, as soon as 20 minutes, because we'll have a load ready in 20 minutes, I'd say. Okay, yeah, definitely. I can I can be down there in, in 20 or so. Okay, that'd be perfect. And then are you just going to truck? Let's see, i got to figure out what co-op we're going to truck to. Um, what are your guys... Your guys always have the highest prices, right? Yep. Okay, we'll just yep. truck back. Uh, yeah, just... I don't know what our price is right now, but our website will have it up. I, I don't know what we're paying out. Okay, yeah, just truck... Honestly, just truck back to your co-op then. That'll work good. All right, will do. Okay, I'll see you then. All right, see ya. You guys on the radio? Wait, Stevia, where are you? I thought you were supposed to be behind me. Uh, I kind of went to the wrong direction. Oh, shoot. Oh, you're at the field se Oh, you're at field seven down there. Oh, shoot. My bad. My bad. I kind of didn't explain what field we were going to. Uh, can I just go for your place to get to field 10? There's a road to the east of our place right there. That It's a gravel okay. road back there. Uh, we're kind of on the... We're we're in the pasture that, or I guess you don't know where the pasture is. We're kind of in the, I, yeah. You'll find us back here, hopefully. So I'm finally to the right field, Grant. I'm coming right behind you. I okay. I see you back in my mirror. Oh wow! I don't know if my yield monitor is just a little cold right now, but I'm showing 210. Really? Yeah. I'm sh I'm showing uh, it's bouncing around like 198 to 202, right about 200. It looks like. Yeah, I don't push as much out of the back like you do so it's probably about right <laughs> yeah <laughs> all right well just let me know when you guys need an unload I'll run over done for so you guys hear about that uh area 51 raid i did i was hearing that i was running the radio this morning when i got up and they're talking about it they're talking uh, about two fail. yeah two youtubers from a different country got arrested at it you know oh, that? that was a couple days ago but yeah 
Yeah, I know. News usually it takes a little while to get to the radio, but yeah. Yeah, apparently it was a big fail. I was watching some stuff on YouTube. Really? I think only like a couple thousand people showed up <laughs> compared to like the two million that were supposed to show up. Yeah. Man, I hate to wake the neighbors here, but uh, we are harvesting right next to their house. It's kind of early in the morning. Hopefully they're up. It looks like they're up. Their lights are on. Man, I don't uh, want to wake them up. It's about 8 o'clock. Yeah, they should be up. If they're not up, well, then on a weekday, then they're obviously not. Yeah, especially with Stevio's combine back there, dude. That thing is loud. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. If they're not awake, they will be. <laughs> there are <laughs> Am I good to back up? I don't know where you're oh. at. All right, hold up, hold up. Yeah, you're good. Austin, if you want to unload me here, here's a perfect spot. I got, I only got about, I got 320 bushels on here. I got about 80 more I could fit on here. But here's a All good right, time. All right, I'll rip up uh, as soon as Steve goes out of the way. Here we go. Run at 7 mile an hour here. Yeah, I'm running at 7 mile an hour. I wonder if Jake might be here fairly soon. We got to watch Jake, out for him. Yeah, Jake's right behind us. I'm, I'm looking through the back window and he's oh, right he, behind us. Oh, he is? Okay. Yeah. Hold up, I might be a little off here. Oh, never mind. How many bushels you got on the cart right now? Uh, my monitor's off. I can't really see it very well. Okay. Austin, you put a little sauce in that coffee this morning? You're a little wet. Yeah, you're all over the road, dude. <laughs> no, I'm just, it, it, yeah, I'm just kidding. Stevio, you're leaving more corn for the deer, dude. Oh, my bad. <laughs> I just want you to get a big buck this year. <laughs> we did have one run out uh, right before you came, actually. Run it, it ran right out in front of the corn. If, uh, if this, uh, if there's any deer in here, this cow bite will get them out. <laughs> I think somebody did put something in that coffee, cause that you can't, Stevie, you're a little crooked there, dude. It, yeah. Did you uh, spike my coffee this morning? No, I, <laughs> I did not. I don't know if Austin no. did. I did not spike. If it was anyone, it was the gas station. Okay. Yeah, just uh, put that in the back hopper here. All right. Austin, your voice sounds a little tired. You must have been screaming all last night. Screaming? What are you talking about? You're at the football game. Why would I be screaming? It's a football game. Yeah, you don't scream when you play actual football. That's right. I apologize. Right. That's right. That's right. Give me an A. <laughs> what? Uh, is there something I'm not getting here? It's the sauce in the coffee. Yeah. Yeah. All right, fellas. Truck is full and rolling out. Then for I'm. I'm curious. Did you guys? Did you guys mistake me for like my twin? That does that. Like a male cheer cheerleader? Huh? I have no idea what you're talking about. Yeah, we, we don't know. Hmm. Okay, well, I have a twin that's one, so that's probably, if you guys are making those jokes, that, that I, I can only assume that's why. Austin, just remember, it's always the grain cart driver's fault. Get out what of my way, man. <laughs> I am. <laughs> I was around. Well, guys, we got a ton more work to do, but this is where... The vlog's gonna end. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. And if you're watching it the day it got released, I'm thinking about doing a live stream tonight also. I'm thinking about it. Not 100% for sure whether I'll live stream or what time it'll be, but I've been considering it because I thought it'd be perfect. And uh, anyways, guys, hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, hit that like button. And hey, I'll see you later. Thanks, guys.